This video is about appreciating the life of Teddy Afro. Offering prayers, and speaking blessings over his life. I am obliged to do this prayer because of the increasing level of targeted killings, and assassination happening in his nation. He is an icon musician, and at high risk. Prayer for protection is imperative. The most recent assassination of the music icon Hachilu, made me aware we need to pray. I was disturbed when I heard on media news, there is a list for high profile names for next target assassination. I wonder, could Teddy also be on the list? Who knows? One thing I know for sure, prayer of believers can push back the works of darkness and evil, and allows the kingdom of peace and love to reign. Prayer will make a difference. I will make another video of prayer for others. But for now. We will focus on praying for Teddy because we love him. We want to preserve and protect what we treasure. Also, we want to bless him so that he may do greater work. I believe our spoken blessings can carry him to the next, and higher level of service. Those of you, my worldwide friends, who are new to the name, you might ask who Teddy Afro is. He is a global icon, pop king musician, and songwriter of our time. He is graced to convey a complex message in a few simple phrases that are memorable, energizing, and loaded with profound truth. His songs and lyrics are timeless. Daddy's pop songs convey the gospel of love, peace, and unity, which is the spirit of our Lord Jesus Christ. His songs convey key historic events, courage, fighting for good, preserving identity, and freedom. His songs celebrate courageous forefathers and leaders of the past. His message through his songs is highly motivational, and gives courage for any battle at hand. One of Teddy's songs is about the legacy of Emperor Menlik II, the victory of Adwa Battle, 1896. Emperor Menlik II, is the pride of nations, who demonstrated what is possible. Adwa is a symbol, the climax victory of free people, over Satan's agents who come to kill, steal, and destroy. Adwa's victory broke the pride of Satan and his agents. Adwa is a victory over evil that comes to take away freedom and brings bondage, takes away life, by bringing bloodshed, violence and oppression. Adwa stopped the plan of robbers of identity, culture, history, dignity, peace, and resources. Adwa was and is an imperative battle for each person who wants to live in dignity. The lesson from Adwa is be courageous, fight for truth, fight for what belongs to you, fight to preserve who you are, do not tolerate anything evil. Do not allow the enemy an inch. Daddy's new song just released, has the same message as Adwa. The only difference is, the name, the timing, and location of the battle is different. Daddy's new song stirs up heroism, and makes you to stand up for what is fair. I believe the spirit of the Bible is the force working behind Teddy's songs. The Bible instruct us to love, to live in peace and unity, to fight for that is good, and just. God is love. He is the Prince of Peace. He is eternal life, abundant life, and the meaning of life. He promised to give his children peace, inner rest, and sweet sleep. We are given the commandment of love, to love God with all our heart, mind and soul and to love one another. Those who believe in him are instructed to be one, live in unity and harmony. Regarding battles the Bible says in Ephesians 6, we have to fight our enemy, Satan, the devil, the accuser, the deceiver, the adversary, the father of lies, the prince of darkness, the power of the air, and the antichrist. He has so many names based on his function, but he is one evil spirit. His agenda is always to steal, kill and destroy. Satan's kingdom works through his human agents. We are instructed not to focus on the human agents. But rather to fight or wage war against Satan himself who is using humans. The battle is spiritual in nature. We are instructed to wear the full spiritual armor for our battle. The full armor includes, salvation, righteousness, peace, truth, faith, the word of God, prayer and perseverance. We are instructed to engage in spiritual battle knowing God is with us, and will help us. God said, I am with you, fight. I will help you, 
fight. I will strengthen you, fight. Fight for your identity, fight for peace, fight for restful life, fight for your health, fight against strong mindsets, fight to protect your mind, fight for what is yours, fight for justice. Resist Satan, do not allow to take your freedom. Do not allow him to disturb your well-being. Fight. The end is known from the beginning. Victory is yours. The gates of hell will not prevail against you. Fight. This is the message of the Bible. Teddy echo this very well. Here is Teddy's message for all. All my music is based on love, like Martin Luther King I believe that, hate is defeated with love, darkness with light. The only choice we have is love. I hope our elders will make the effort to collaborate, find a resolution that will leave the country better off for the next generation. Instead of distancing ourselves, let's come together. Rather than misunderstanding each other, let's communicate. Instead of conflict, let's love one another and long for peace. Instead of holding a grudge let's forgive one another. Teddy Afro motto, the love we inherit is greater than the resentment we inherit. In late 2008, Teddy was deliberately wrongly accused and imprisoned for two years. It is no surprise, the battle is spiritual in nature. It was the bottle between the light of God working in Teddy's life. Versus the spirit of darkness that run the system of the nation. The system known for operating by the principle of divide and rule, control and manipulation, hate and genocide, deceit and stealing of resources. Most of the leaders were, and are Satan worshippers. Their hands are drenched with many innocent blood. Their acts, and rule demonstrate the principles of Satan. Teddy's songs are the antidote that makes the works of Satan crumble. Teddy's one song has the power to destroy irreversibly, many years of works of Satan. His divine songs stir up many hearts for the purpose of the good. His songs help the youth to follow the right path. I am obliged to pray for Teddy Afro, as he is my brother in the kingdom of light. Teddy is an ambassador of love, peace, and unity. I am obliged to pray for his protection. Prayer for Teddy Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you for the life of Teddy. He is a vessel in your hand for the honor of your name. Thank you for choosing him to be your voice. He is declaring your kingdom in this dark world. Lord, I pray you protect him from the spirit of darkness. In your faithfulness and love, protect Teddy from the evil one and his kingdom. Watch over him day and night. His coming in and his going out. Protect him from the spirit that comes to kill, steal and destroy. Put your protection hedge of fire round him. Send terror in the heart of anyone, who intends to harm Teddy in any way. Hide Teddy and his family under the shadow of your wings. Hide them in you. Make them safe and secured. Let your peace rule the heart of Teddy and his family. Let those who came against him one way, flee in seven ways. Raise your standard against the enemy, I pray. Let the enemy gathering, counsel, plot, scheme. Be destroyed by the power of your name. Let your angels guard Teddy. Lord, shield Teddy from Satan, and his operations. I pray based on Psalm 91. Protect Teddy from the enemy snare. Arrow by day, terror by night. Pestilence, plague, harm, disaster, witchcraft, enchantment, divination, wickedness, and from all human Satan's agents. You fight the battle for Teddy. Lead him always in triumph, in Christ Jesus. Blessing proclamation on Teddy and his family. I bless you in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ over you and your family. May you be blessed with the awareness of the blood of Jesus. That speaks over you mercy, blessing and favor, day and night. May God shepherd you all the days of your life. May your heart grow strong to love and serve God. May you be like Ephraim and Minas. Walk in the fear of the Lord, peace and integrity. Maintain a high level of spirituality and character in this secular environment. May you remain faithful to God even when it is a tough environment. May you be blessed with God's strength to swim upstream against a tide of society. 
May the kindness in your heart radiate to those around you. May excellent spirit, knowledge, wisdom and understanding be found in you, like Daniel. May you be zealous for the name of Lord, like David. May the blessing of his grace and favor rest upon you. May salvation, redemption, wisdom, righteousness and holiness be your portion forever. May the Holy Spirit produce abundant fruit of righteousness in you. May inner rest be your portion. May your success be many. May health and strength be your portion. May you remain blessed and highly favored. Alleluia. Thank you God for hearing my prayers. Let your angels hearken by the words I have spoken, and bring it to pass. Your word says, The prayer of the righteous avails much. I am your child, righteous in the Lord Jesus Christ. My prayers and declarations, in your name are effective. They will set motions in the spiritual world, and bring the desired result. Whatever I bless is blessed. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Stay blessed Teddy. I have one assignment for you. Please, make one song on the resurrection and victory of our Lord Jesus Christ. His victory is the ultimate victory of all. Thanks. Dear believers, the word said, If two of you shall agree on earth concerning anything that you shall ask, it shall be done for you by the Father who is in heaven. I ask you to agree on the prayers and blessings spoken on Teddy by pressing any button. If you wish, press subscribe, or thumbs up, or write a comment. Please let me know if you need any special prayers. I can include them in my future videos. Let the peace and grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be upon you. Have a blessed day. Goodbye for now until we meet again.